very much. Well, we're following some breaking news here this morning. A domestic dispute that quickly turned into a police-involved shooting. That's right. Our Anna Carrera is in Newcastle for us this morning where this all unfolded. Anna, can you break down exactly what happened here? Yeah, Ben and Julia, we're just a few blocks away from the police station as actually where police had to come here and show up. And you can see some police crime tape here at this home, but the real action happened behind the home is what we're told. Police tell us a man stabbed a woman in the neck, so they took action too. Here's what we know so far. Police were called out here for some kind of a domestic disturbance. And we're on Church Street, just outside the downtown area. Now, we don't know their exact relationship, but police say the man and woman involved here were acquaintances and had been fighting with officer or had been fighting before officers got here. Here's what happened next. Two officers from Newcastle Police Department arrived, um, one going to the front, one going to the rear of the house. Um, they were met by a, a man, a woman running from a knife wielding man. The man stabbed, stabbed the woman in the neck with a large knife and the officer fired on the s suspect hitting him. Now, both the suspect and victim have been flown to hospitals in Indianapolis. The victim, 38-year-old Aaron Mahan, who lived a few blocks away. The suspect, 41-year-old Brandon Lee Flowers, lives here where the stabbing and the shooting happened. We'll be here throughout the morning here on Sunrise and bring you the very latest information as we get it. Ben and Julia. All right, Anna, thank you.